I hear an awful lot of people in this chamber talk about those with disabled disabilities and us trying to do things to help them. But I'll be damned if we don't have the chance tonight to hear the very next bill that opens up the doors of medical science. Because I pray to God every time I close my eyes that one day my wife, I have the chance to have that opportunity again to be able to walk. It makes you feel a personal responsibility that you need to kind of fight for and bring hope to people who've basically lost hope. What was so powerful is that we were able to all come together and pass something that will make a difference in the lives of Texans and hopefully American citizens. I think we have laid the framework in for other states to be able to follow quickly. Ethically, this needs to be moved forward. We realized early on that physicians really need to understand the truth about stem cells. It's not science fiction, it's biology. One of the joys of using stem cells is there's almost always lots of upside and no downside. In the tens of thousands of administrations that we've given, there have been no serious adverse events. I went into practice because I wanted to help people. Not just put band-aids on people, but really get to the root cause and fix it. And that's exactly what this is. Patient after patient after patient continuing to see these miraculous changes. She was back to training for marathons. To her, that was a miracle. To me, um, I wasn't surprised. It's one of those things that are too good to be true. Tell me why you're so emotional. As of a month ago, he doesn't wear oxygen at all. This is your life. This is the life of your wife or your husband, your sons, your daughters, your family members. What does your wife think of the new you? We go on so many dates, I don't know where to start. I'm just glad she's happy. It is so exciting what's going on. You know, the fact that you could literally take your own stem cells and bank them and have them available. This could benefit me, my family, and just think of the larger implications of actually helping all of the, you know, the people that I've served with and I see that, you know, they're in just as much pain. Neurological conditions, things like Parkinson's, MS, ALS, traumatic brain injury, autoimmune diseases, diabetes, lung, heart, kidney, essentially any organ or tissue inside your body that needs to have healing can be used with these cells. You know, it's not the fountain of youth, but maybe it's some droplets from the fountain of youth. You're putting these cells in that actually regrow tissue. I played 16 years, 100 or more games a year. Since then, I've been able to speak to a lot of people, not just athletes, who have gone through this process and have had raving reviews about it. I know the research that's going on right now, in a year, will just blow away what we're talking about today. Can you imagine if we can not just take care of injuries and diseases, but actually even prolong healthy, functional life? This is revolutionizing medicine as we know it.